Today, we're going to go over the top 10 fastest electric cars in the world. Make sure to watch until number 1. Number 10. Drayson Racing B12, 69 EV. Lord Drayson wants to compete in his Lola LMP1 car, an electric motor on each wheel. This car is a beast, a thoroughbred racing chassis, and has won the American Le Mans series and the Asian Le Mans series with flex fuel. Engines and biofuels. The electric motor never made it to the track, but it still made a deep impression. The power of this car is 640 kilowatts, 850 horsepower, and the torque limit is 2,950 pounds per foot, 4,000 newton meters, split between four motors. Drayson Racing B12, 69 EV has a top speed of 204 miles per hour. It reached 60 miles per hour in 3 seconds and 100 miles per hour in 5.1 seconds, but the 30 kilowatt hour battery is a weakness, and it will be difficult for the car to compete with diesel and hybrids that have become the dominant force in terms of cruising range. Power cars compete in the sports car race. It was not crucial in the sprint race held at Elvington Airport in Northern England in June 2013. Number 9. Genovation GXE. It is a bit confusing, the official world's fastest road car is far below this list, but it will never compete with vehicles with a speed record, and Remac has not set an official time. Innovation will lose its current USP record. An American-made car is an electrified version of the Corvette Z06, which recorded this speed at Cape Canaveral in early 2017, breaking its record. Genovation GXE has a top speed of 205.6 miles per hour. The engine has an output of 660 horsepower and a torque of 602 pound-feet, 816 newton meters, making the Genovation as fast as most road cars. Number 8. Ford Fusion 999. It is a bit different because it has a hydrogen fuel cell that drives a 770 horsepower electric motor. It is another Bonneville salt flat, so the Ford Beast has no practical use other than going straight. Blue Oval built a Frankenstein monster with a NASCAR chassis, but not on its own. Ohio State University also participated in the development of this car. It was the idea of the students, and Ford agreed. The Ford Fusion 999 now weighs 6,700 pounds, 3,039 kilograms, and the vehicle contains two high-pressure hydrogen cylinders as part of the vehicle. Ford Fusion has a top speed of 207 miles per hour. The engine has an output of 350 kilowatts and is powered by an inverter and a 770 horsepower electric motor, combined with the Ford GT six-speed gearbox. Number 7. Neo EP9. Except for the only car known here, this is probably the most complex car because only 10 are sold to the public. NIO, the Chinese company that makes EP9 has close ties to Formula E and EP9. They are designed in cooperation with the Formula E racing department. This car has several world records, including the fastest lap time in an autonomous vehicle at a US circuit. The NIO EP9 can reach a top speed of 217 miles per hour, and it only takes 2.7 seconds to accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour. In addition, the car is a single-wheel drive, which means that each wheel has its gearbox. It has a power of 1,000 kilowatts and can travel about 265 miles per charge. Number 6. Automobili Pininfarina Battista. Unlike the other entries on our list of the fastest electric cars globally, Automobili Pininfarina is an Italian company established much longer than many of us. It was founded in 1930, but the owners changed hands in the past 10 years, and the company started. The company is working hard to produce this incredible technology. Automobili Pininfarina Battista can reach an astonishing 217 miles per hour and accelerate from 0 to 100 miles per hour in less than 2 seconds. Battista can produce 1,900 horsepower and 2,300 newton meters of torque. It is worth noting that this car is equipped with Remac batteries. Yes, it is the same Remac that created the other two entries in this list. It may also be worth noting that the top speed of both machines is higher than that of Battista. Some Rimic cards are pinned to the chest. Pininfarina will only produce 150 Batista units. Whether or not it is as competitive as Remac cars, it will remain a coveted commodity. Number 5. Remac Concept S Although the torque is 1,328 pound-feet, 1,800 newton meters, the monster Remac with 1,032 kilowatts, 1,384 horsepower, is not easy. It is an exquisite version of Concept 1, which finally hit the market and became popular. Name supercars like La Ferrari on long-distance routes. Concept 1 broke the rules of electric supercars, and Concept S took them to a new level. Remac Concept S has a top speed of 227 miles per hour. The car reaches 60 miles per hour in 2.5 seconds, reaches 125 miles per hour in 5.6 seconds, and accelerates to 185 miles per hour in 13.1 seconds. It's almost crazy, this car pushed the Bugatti Chiron onto the wire. 
incredible engineering, unfortunately, Rimic only sold two of them. Number 4. A Spark Owl Hypercar. The Aspark Owl supercar is so elite that buyers must apply for purchase before production. I haven't heard from Aspark, which is understandable because the company is relatively new to faster electric vehicles. It was established about 16 years ago and is mainly dedicated to providing engineering services to other companies. Aspark showed off the prototype of its first and so far only model, the Aspark Owl. A Spark Owl has a top speed of 249 miles per hour, accelerating from 0 miles per hour to 100 miles per hour in 1.69 seconds. Owl has a 1,300 kilowatt battery and can travel 280 miles. This car is only about 40 inches, so entering is like entering a racing car and lying down. Number 3. Tesla Roadster. This car has been in development for more than 8 years, but we don't have to wait a long time to see the first Tesla sports car hit the streets. About four years ago, Elon Musk first demonstrated this new car at Tesla. The Tesla Roadster can reach a top speed of 250 miles per hour and accelerate from 0 miles per hour to 60 miles per hour in 1.9 seconds. Over the years, Tesla has gained fame for its luxury electric vehicles and recently launched several more affordable entry-level models, but the opposite is true. Compared with models like Remax C underscore 2, the price tag of this sports car pales in comparison. This convertible sports car will be equipped with a 200 kWh battery and provide 10,000 Newton meters of torque for the wheels. This electric supercar will also be fitted with a retractable glass roof, and all Tesla patented features that consumers expect. Number 2. Remac Concept 2. Remac Automobili recently believed that the Concept S supercar was not enough for them. Explore the Remac Concept 2 car. Remac Concept 2 has a top speed of 258 miles per hour. Accelerate to 60 miles per hour in 1.85 seconds. C underscore 2 is essentially a racing car because it provides a virtual driving trainer to help the driver recognize the racing line and acceleration signs. The craziest thing is that it is still a street car. If you live with a very wealthy person, you may not see anyone driving around your town, but this car is legal on ordinary roads, so you never know that you might be there at some point. See it on the driveway of McDonald's. Number 1. Venturi Buckeye Bullet 3. You might learn about Venturi from his heroic deeds in Formula E or a series of crazy electric concepts he proposed after moving away from the world of exclusive gasoline supercars, but there are other things. The Buckeye Bullet 3 is for all time. Land speed record. The car is shaped like a long ball. It is not designed for turning, stopping, or anything other than top speed. The Ohio State University Automotive Research Center is known for its record zero emission speed. In 2004, nickel hydrogen battery electric vehicles set a record of 303 miles per hour, and in 2009, hydrogen fuel cell vehicles set another record. In 2015, we used a Venturi tube and a 2 MW lithium-ion battery. Roger Schroe set a two-way record at an average speed of over 240 miles per hour at the legendary Bonneville Salt Flats. Now the car is far below the record, but the convoy is back. It is currently struggling at a speed of 372 miles per hour, but the surface degradation prevents the team from reaching the salt flats. The ultimate goal is an electric car that can break the 400 miles per hour mark, although the team may continue to move forward. Subscribe and turn on notifications, so you don't miss more videos like this and much more. Check out this playlist of my top 10 videos, and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.